big howdy everyone, my name is Nick on the ZX Spectrum 48k, no I lie, it's 128k, get it right Nick, get it right. Well, this game is called Buffalo Bill's Wild West Adventure, published by Timesoft in 1989. It's a game, well it's a collection of mini games really, so we'll see how we get on. There's the mini games, knife throwing, trick shooting, calf roping, bronco riding, steer wrestling and stagecoach rescue, which I'll try and come to as we go through. The game was also known as Wild West Rodeo in some parts, I'm going to have it on easy mode because I'm no nincompoop. Uh, this isn't about expert gameplay of course, it's about seeing how you would have got on in your first or second go, and would have been enough there for you to want to go and play it again. Would there? I don't know. It's why time soft makes me a bit worried. I will edit down the loading times which are, well, quite big. Game also came out on the Commodore Amiga, Android CBC, Atari ST, BBC Micro Commodore 64, right, press fire, right, left a bit, right a bit. So I've got to throw knives, I think, at a spinning disc with a woman on board, and I've got to try and avoid uh, not hitting her with the knives. If I hit her with the knives, it's game over, big nose, it's knife throwing. So I've got this little thing here. Now, it's staying pretty level, but I think, oops, I've, I've, I've stabbed her to death. Um, it's staying pretty level, but on the more difficult mode, the thing's shifting about a bit, a bit like the aiming mechanism on the game 180, if you remember that. Would you like to replay this? Yes, I would. So we're in the Wild West, playing a number of mini-games. Music is good. Right, I've missed her that time. If you are a woman on a spinning disc with knives being thrown at you, then comment in the comment section below. But uh, yes, I suppose you got a few cuts and grazes. Nick, disastrous shot. What what can I do? What can I do? Now, please subscribe. No, don't do that. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. That helps the channel grow. Uh, make me better at knife throwing as well. So good graphics on the spinning, and I, oh, I've knifed her straight away. Am I going to get better at this? No, well, you don't have to be successful on one game to get to the next mini game. Uh, six in total, so I'll probably see all of them. Let's just do this one last time. Let's go a little bit wide here. Let's not go for the belly button, that's a problem. Right, good. That's one that was quite close to her leg. Come on, let's do this thing. Good, we've got two in there, three. Look at my score shooting up. Bonus is going down, you can see. If I get all the uh, remaining four knives in there, uh, before the bonus has gone down to zero, I get that as a bonus. Right, here we go. It's happening this time. Duh, 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 duh. It's the Wild West. We're throwing knives at some yellow woman on a spinning disc. What could be much more fun than that? Other um, Western games are Kane and uh, the Wild Bunch. Oh, I like the Wild Bunch. That's pretty cool. Right, good. I've done that. I've completed the first mini game. So well done to me. I would say a huge thank you to the members, so I will. Massive thank you, huge thank you to the members keeping this channel growing. Uh, if you want to become a member, it's not compulsory, uh, there's a join button there if you're watching this on the main uh, site. Hooray! It doesn't join you straight away, of course. There's a bit of a discussion before then. Right, Nick, knock down the bad guy targets. Right, this is like a shooting gallery, I think. The Grand Canyon here, or the wasteland is not red, it isn't brown. Right, here we go. So, I need to shoot the good guys and shoot... No, I need to shoot the bad guys, that's better, and um, uh, don't shoot the good guys. I think I might have to reload the gun, because there's a reload button. Right, he's... Hmm. How am I doing here? Right, he can get shot. Uh, right. Um, this reminds me slightly of the shooting part in Daily Thompson's Super Test, although not a great deal of fun. Uh, for Tynesoft, this isn't a bad little game, really, graphically. Uh, the previous games I reviewed, like uh, We The Same Pet and a few others on Timesoft, are notoriously bad. Uh, this one um, seems okay, so maybe they had a bit of help on this one. 1989, redefinable keys. Very interesting to see what it looks like on the Commodore Amiga, so I might have to come to that at some stage. Uh, score 200, looks like I'm getting points for shooting bad guys and losing points for shooting good people. Right, um, reload, I think. Right, I've reloaded there. Mm. It's a little bit dull, isn't it? Graphically, it's good. Uh, first first game, well, it's all right. I, I have to try and put it in the perspective of me playing it as a kid. Um, and as a kid, I would have bought this because I was into the Wild West. Uh, is it representing the Wild West? Yeah, in a selection of mini-games. Um, I do like future games, though, set in space. This is also mini-games. A little bit weirder uh, than this one, it has to be said. Kane was mini-games uh, also in the Wild West 2, which I didn't mind. Uh, Kane 2, come out on the Commodore 64, didn't make it to the ZX Spectrum as far as I'm aware yet at least, unless someone does a homebrew. Yeah, so this one also came out on the Commodore 64. If you played it on those other systems, then let me know how it differs. Right, I got to the end there. Music! Bom 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 bom! 
It's quite jolly, this. Well done, Scienceoff. This might be your best game you've ever done. Uh, right, now I need to shoot bottles on this second part. Uh, that guy, he's jumping, jumping up and throwing whiskey bottles around. Have I got any? Well, I don't think so. Um, yeah, this is a little bit tricky. This game is crying out for a light gun, really, than using the uh, keys or, or a joystick. Uh, that cactus is very, very green against the red background. It's like we're on Mars. Maybe we're not in the Wild West in the USA. Maybe we're on Mars. If you are on Mars and this is going on, then comment below. The sky looks a bit blue for Mars, though, so maybe they've started a bit of terraforming or something like that. What do I know? I'm just some crazy nincompoop commentating on this crazy game. Biff, baff, boff. Right, hang on a minute. Do 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 boo 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 Come on big nose Right what's up next what's up next Sunny Jim Uh right it's loading we'll edit down the loading times as I say if you're playing this it's loading taking a bit longer to load well don't blame me I edited it down to try and try and make a little bit more of an entertaining video Might have done it I don't know right ride them cowboy what do I do here? So we're trying to um, calm this, we're, roping, we're trying to rope the cup, so I think we need to, um, like uh, Jay Thompson Kaplan, waggle the joystick a little bit, or keys, and um, get alongside the thing, I'm the blue one, and then press fire button to rope this runaway, well it's supposed to be a horse, looks more like a tiger or something, right, okay, we're in hot pursuit baby, time is ticking up rather than down, I missed, I missed, I missed the critter, right, okay, have another go, would you like to replay? Uh, this is this is a bit dull. This one, a uh, nice. It's well, scrolling. Okay, it's not uh, anything super exciting going on. Oh well, look, I my fingers are hurting trying to catch up. I don't know if this is a waggling thing or not, but I'm not catching this critter up. That's for sure. I I, I need to I need the pleasure of being back in the day where I didn't mind breaking a joystick because I wasn't playing for the thing, so I had no relevance. I was just keep going for fun. Uh, can I get round here? No, I've fallen off. Nick, another one bites the dust. Did a dun dun dun. Another one bites the dust. Oh, I'm never going to do this. Right, this will be my last go. Rope the calf. It's a calf running away. So some, it's some some crazy cow or bronco or something. It's a cow, a cow of doom. If you are a cow of doom, then comment below what you're doing watching this. Should there be other stuff you'd be doing like eating grass and processing it through your free stomachs? Um, I've, I've only got one stomach, I'm not a show-off like you. Uh, but anyway, I doubt you own a ZX Spectrum, so in your face, cow. Oh man, I've gone again. This is unique commentary, you're never going to find commentary elsewhere. But it's 128k, I believe there's a 48k version, I guess it plays similar but without the music. You might have played this as Wild West Rodeo, but I've got it under the slightly longer title of Buffalo Bill's Wild West Adventure. I don't think, well, I, Buffalo Bill was a real person, I think. I'm not sure he did all this stuff. I think he's just some crazy outlaw um, making a name for himself, shooting people, doing stuff where he shouldn't do, uh, leaving the toilet seat up. All the things that made you an enemy in the Wild West. Yeah, man. Right, I, I like Clint Eastwood. He's not appearing in this, or the man with no name, or Blondie, as he's called in one of these spaghetti westerns. Blondie! Yeah, there we go. So you'll be, you'll be playing this game a little while, only because it takes a while to load each individual game. I'm, I'm not big on this mini game. Uh, they could do without this, but if it had been a mini game within the wild bunch, then really it would have added extra fun to the thing. Uh, the only mini, uh, the only sort of ga mini game in the wild bunch, because really, it's more mainly text, is the, the shootout you can have at high noon. High noon, baboon. Would you like to replay this event? No, I wouldn't. Right, next up, next up. Put your favourite event so far. I know it's tough. You might not be watching this video up to this point. Um, some people just watch the first couple of seconds and give me a bit of information that I've already given in the video uh, there. Um, so, you know, what can you do? I don't tend to answer those ones. Nick, what we got to do here? Follow, right, okay. So I, I, this is a bucking bronco and I presume by pressing the right keyboard keys, uh, what the arrows are showing me on the screen, I've got to stay on the thing. Ride them big, oh, I'm off. Ride them big nose. 190 bonus. I didn't stay on there very long. There's a mechanical bucking bronco I saw uh, before you can get on in the real world, loosely speaking. I've never had a go on it, but it just bucks you all around the place. Looks great fun, as long as you're not playing it um, next to a lake full of piranhas. 
or alligators or stuff like that. Uh, I don't know if you're into that sort of dangerous sports. I'm not really a dangerous sport pe person. Skydiving um, without a parachute, that's pretty dangerous. Uh, rock climbing, all those sort of stuff. Um, uh, bear wrestling. I, I Back in Bronco, a bit tough for me. I, I played a game of Tiddlywinks once and it was quite windy. Uh, that was quite a dangerous sport. You could blow in your eye or something like that. No Tiddlywinks games as far as I'm aware. That yellow horse butts me off again. Would you like to... Re right, okay. Oh, look. To tuck a pepper in his hat and call it macaroni. I would have played this game a little bit, but not excessively. I mean, by without me playing it whatsoever. So that, that could have happened as well. Right. I think the video should be about 10 minutes. This is going to be longer due to the amount of mini games on the darn thing. Next event, event 5 of 6. Uh, right, now grab it by the horns and wiggle. What's that mean? Wiggle it just a little bit. Acid groove. Uh, right, I'll try and do that. Um, I think we've got to... Yes, I don't know what we've got to do here. There's a variety of music though, I have to say. Right, here I go. I'm that red horse at the top. I'm doing... I'm, I'm wiggling... Oops. I am, I am whiffling. Not whiffling, wiggling the joystick as much as I can. Or keyboarding. I'm keyboarding, I'm not doing any wiggle. Right, so I need to, I need to catch that thing there. I'm the, I'm the, well, I don't know who I am now. I'm one of them. Right, come on, I'm the red one at the back, I think. Or I'm the one at the top, I don't know. It's a nice bit of shadowing, I know I've fallen off. I'm the red one at the top. I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. I have read the instructions, but it's not clear. It's just wiggle it and press fire button. Disaster. Absolute disaster. Look at the animation on the, uh, the horses, though. They're pretty decent. Yeah, if you've seen any of the other games reviewed by Timesoft, this is leagues and leagues ahead. Leagues and leagues ahead. It's going on a bit too long, though, and I think they maybe should have concentrated on maybe slightly less mini games and made them a little bit better. The earlier ones are better than these later ones, in my opinion. But anyway, good, good. We're doing various bits and pieces. Would have kept it occupied. The shadowing is quite cleverly coded on this one, that is for sure. Right, time's ticking up. I don't know how long we got. Probably about 20 minutes. Oof, yeah. 20 minutes? No, 20 seconds. Couldn't play this for 20 minutes. Glances at the clock. Yeah, as I say, if you had this on any system, let me know what your experiences were. You might have got a bit out of it than what I do playing it um, and now. So this should be uh, the very last event, i guessing. Unless it goes on forever, right. So this is a stage stagecoach rescue. And this is the best graphics of all of them, right? So I'm there to, look at the detail in this. They should have made the game all like this. Anyway, so I'm trying to waggle the joystick, no, hit the keyboard, to get my horse in the background, avoiding all these things being thrown at me to get to the top of that stagecoach. And then I'm gonna have a bit of a fight, I think. Right, I'm, I'm level through it. Nick, you have exhausted yourself. Well, not for the, not for the first time or last time. Right, I just wanna get on that stagecoach. Come on, baby, we can do this thing. Send me your positive powers. Du -du -du -du. Come on, Nick. A hero is needed here. Come on, we got there. Come on, get on. Get on the stagecoach. How'd you get on? I'm pressing fire button. Oh, man. There's an engine up there. Red engine. Throwing stuff. Come on, I must be on it. Oh, I'm going to exhaust myself in a minute. I'm pressing fire button. Get me on that stagecoach. This is like Red Dead Redemption, only better graphics. Look, I mean, this is this is really smoothly animated, this, compared to some of the upside. I'm, oh, yes, I'm up there, right, fighting. Right, punch, 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 don't mess this up. Fluke a win. I'm hitting all the buttons now. Punch, block, punch, kick. I can't kick. Punch, punch, punch. Take that, Native American Indian person. Oh, man. Is this true to the story? Look at the wheels going around as well. That's good. Right. The horses are going on. I don't know who's in this stagecoach, but we're trying to battle them for victory. Oh, this could go on for years. Um, they should have made the whole game variations of this, made it a Red Dead sort of game. I've done it! Hooray! Well, the review, by my own weak standards, is a success. What a performance! Well, you know, I tried my best. My first go, really. I, I can't brag. Bomb, bomb, bomb. But would you like to replay this event? No, because I've completed it with a great form. So there's, there's, a, there's a round up there. Knife throwing, that's quite good. Trick shooting, quite good. Calf roping, terrible. Bronco riding, okay. Steer wrestling, goddamn awful. Stagecoach rescue, super duper ooper. I like the knife ride the best, that woman on the uh, the roundy disc. So I would like to have a look at that one. Overall, I liked it, although it went on a bit too long. And some of the minigames 
we could have done without. But anyway, it was it was fun regardless. So hope you like having a look at that game. That was Buffalo Bills Wild West Adventure, published by Tinesoft. They finally done a half decent one in 1989. Got any comments about this game, similar games, anything retro or spectrum based, then by all means put that in the comment section below. You're always more than welcome. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.